take appointment to see Dr. Janice, please. Right, and when did you want to come? Ah, uh, what times have you got available? We've got a short surgery running this afternoon. Um, if you can stop now, I can make an appointment now. Yeah. Wait, it will be yeah. on Thursday. Yeah. Okay. Today? Thank you. Right. Yeah. Can I take your name, please? Thank you, please. Please. The Right, so it'll be, it'll be shortly. If you take a seat, Mrs. Wayne, okay, then, thank okay? You. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Hello there. Hello, Dr. Janice. Come and take a seat. Right. I've got my bad arm. Do you like to? <laughs> What's happened to it? I don't know what it is altogether. Oh, you've grazed it, haven't you? How did you do it? Well, I, I bumped up against a wall, but I didn't think I had that much to it. Do you think you've got any gravelly stuff in it? No. Do you mind if I just have a, have a little look? No. Is it very sore? Yeah, it is really. Um, I was just thinking, I haven't seen you for a while, and um, I haven't checked your blood pressure, no. so okay. once we've had a look at this arm, maybe we should just check yeah. your blood pressure okay. as well. Are you still taking your tablets? Yeah. You are, every morning? Yeah. Mm, there, there was a bit of gravel in there. Mm -hmm. um, yes, what we need to do with your arm is, is um, we need to get the nurse in, yeah. give your arm a good clean, put a dressing on and, and bandage it up. Right. OK? Yeah. Could I have the other arm, though, just to check your blood pressure? Let's give you the wrong one, won't you? <laughs> Can we just push your sleeve up a bit higher? Lovely. Just wrap that round. Can I just get you to turn your arm around? Lovely. That's fine. Lovely. Okay, so if you don't mind just waiting a minute, we'll get the nurse yeah. and okay. um, she can come and, yeah. and clean, clean the wound and address it for right. you. Janice at 3.15. Okay, in the name please. Mr T. Smart. Okay, take a seat Mr Smart please, thank you. Right, the doctor just wanted us to clean your arm, didn't she? Yeah. And we'll put a dressing on for you. Okay, well it's grey, so we we'll just clean there. Excellent. I'll just put a bandage round as well to keep it in place. If you could keep that on for a day and come back tomorrow. Um, can you come back tomorrow evening and yeah. we'll check it again? Okay. Thank you. I think so, Doctor. Oh dear. Let uh, me move the scales out of the way for you. Um, perhaps yeah. if I could get you to lie up there and, and maybe take your shoes off and just roll your trouser legs up just yeah. above your knee. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to test your reflexes. I'm going to put my arm underneath your knees. Can you just rest the weight of your knees onto my arm? That's lovely. Just relax in. Lovely. Um, apart from the, the problem with the limping, is, is there anything else going on? Well, just recently, I've got a rash that's come on my chest. Mm. And... Uh, 
How's your weight been? Well, I've lost, I've lost weight too. Have you? Yeah. Yeah. Could That's I just the... check your temperature actually? Do you mind just putting that under your tongue? That's great. And just close your mouth around it. And we just need to give it a little while to, um, to cook. That's lovely. Let's see what that shows. Hmm, that is up a bit actually. Yeah, um, could I just get you on the scales? If I can get you to come and come onto the scales here. Okay. So that's showing that you're 15 stone and last time we checked your weight you were actually 16 stone so so you've lost a whole stone a whole stone in weight um, as far as the limping is concerned and the reflexes that we tested on the couch I think I'm going to um, get another doctor to see you about that in the hospital um, so you'll get an appointment through the post <coughs> about that yeah. um, the the temperature because your temperature was up a bit when we measured it um, what I suggested you for that is actually to take some paracetamol and that will help to bring your temperature down um, and the weight so if I can get you to come back in a week's time and see me again and we'll just check your weight again right doctor okay, okay. Then. lovely bye bye then hello Hi. there hello Karen come on then good girl good girl right so my lap here are we you go Paulie? Oh, are, are you Paulie? are you awake haven't you a sore awake? throat oh dear she seems very hot <coughs> mm. oh dear did the earache keep you awake last night did it yes. Oh dear, can yeah. we have a little look, Jessica? Shall oh. have a look? Can we have a little look, Karen? Let's have a little look, shall we? Hey, good girl. What lovely hair you've got. One little ear. That looks a bit red, actually. Dear. Yeah. Can we just turn you around and have a look at the other one? There we go. Good girl. You've got lovely pretty hair, haven't you? Oh, that looks a bit red too. Poor you. Oh. Can we see down your throat now? Now, how wide can you open your mouth? Really wide, forward. Good girl. That's lovely, that is. And can I just feel your neck? Yeah, she's got some glands up in her neck as well. Okay. Yeah. Right, and can we listen to your chest? Can we lift up your top and have a listen? Oh, have a listen. Where's that tummy? Should we find your tummy? Good girl. Now, there this is. is a bit cold. Just warm it up a bit because that's a bit cold. There we are. Can you do some big breaths in and out? Can you do that? Good girl. And we can, can we just turn you around a little bit so we can listen to the back there of you? Go. Could you do some big breaths with her to right, try and yeah, encourage sure. her? Ready? Big breaths. Go. Good girl. In and out. Good girl. Well done. Good girl. Okay, that's lovely. Um, her chest is actually completely clear, Good. but she's got red ears on both sides. Okay. They'll be sore, and um, right. her throat looks quite sore. So you'll need some medicine, some <gasps> pink medicine, some Barbie medicine. Oh, wow! Um, and you need to take that four times a day. Right, lovely. Okay. Okay. Now it might take um, ooh, a day or two for her to begin to feel better. Right, so okay. while she's while she's taking the medicine, um, the antibiotics, she's also probably going to need Calpol right, for the first okay. couple of days. <coughs> No problem. Right, so if you take that to the chemist, all right, and then they'll give you a bottle of medicine and then you can take that and then you can feel better. Okay. Do you think we should give you a sticker because you've been really, really good girl at the doctors? That'd be good. Shall we? That says, I was good at the doctor's today. There you go. There you go, say so thank you. Thank you. Good girl. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. thanks, bye-bye. Right. Bye-bye. Okay. Good girl.